thousand years on this planet and they knew a lot more than us today what did the ancient people knew what we don't know now a lot for example let us play with some magnets here it is ha, old fashioned magnet north pole south pole let's bring in some long magnets too Point the opposite poles. Contraction. Ah, some force. Let's rotate the long magnet. Now let's see if we can shape the magnet a little bit different. Now bring back the long magnets. Wow, did you see that? Again. We can conclude magnets produce force. Force means motion, and motion means rotation. The Mayan engine. Einstein said, if you are very close to the speed of light, time and space will bend. James Clark Maxwell, founder of the Maxwell Equations. We need this to understand the graphitomagnetism we are trying to reach. Graphitomagnetism can provide us anti-gravity and the time-space bending. this great scientist. He knew how to transport electricity without wires. 116 years ago, okay. He also discovered a way to provide everybody on this planet of free power, without harming the environment at all. Hmm, that's strange. It's not fair to place good love and great scientist in such a dark light.
So we have the power on place. But it still won't work. We need a superfluid. A fluid with no resistance at all. If we can get our hands on such a fluid, we need a very good container to hold it. Because if there is a hole of just the size of one atom of the fluid, then the fluid runs through instantly. We are getting closer now. Fill it up now, but we forgot a very important thing. Yes, the ring. The ring is a fluid too. Ferro fluid. Who makes the ring due the magnetic force? Now the setup is complete and we can start the engine. If you're interested in more information on this topic, please view the film Anti-Gravity Physics Explained on the YouTube channel. Much more information, awesome work, a great hero puts that on the net. Thank you very much for watching.